For this episode, I want to show you a little more of the rust repair on the back side of the car. First episode, I already showed you that the car had some rust in the corners and it was patched with a little panel. And it's the same thing on the other side. They patched this hole in the floor with just like a patch with a few tack welds, but the rust is still here. And it also has the hole behind the light. Over here, I marked out some lines. The bottom black line is the outline of the stock OEM white body arch that can be glued on here. And the red line would be where I would cut the metal approximately. On top of that, and this is another marking, is for the customized arch that I made. It's a little higher, it's a little wider, so I think that's better. Uh, so I'm thinking I'm gonna cut out the top one right away and install that arch just you know so the rear wheels will fit perfectly not scrape at all when I started poking at it it turned out it was actually much worse than I initially expected and a lot of rust was hidden by filler and painted over so when I got to taking off the exhaust I noticed there was a giant hole and the back of the repair was like not treated at all was just a big rusty hole with still jagged edges and just you know a sheet of metal slapped over it and tacked on uh, the material that I replaced I had a sketch of it on the board it's like the, the outer skin of the car bumper mount inner fender boot floor inner skin of the car this is the over blender that I stuck on and everything that's scratched out is gone. It was literally just rusted and gone. And I replaced initially the boot floor, then the inner fender, and then the bumper mount, and then the bumper mount bracket. I also completely replaced that, which I'll just cut in some footage to show you. all the old repairs cleaned up the hole and I welded in a whole bunch of new material uh, so after welding in new material I gave it a coat of paint then another coat of paint next up when the paint dries I'll be sealing the welded edges with some 
uh, polyurethane body sealing, like welding sealer. And then after that, I'll give it a coat of paint so it's kind of, you know, grayish black, just like the rest of the car. So yeah, this is almost done. We'll just need a coat of the body sealer and then a quick coat of black paint to seal it up. And after that, we'll be putting it on the road again. Make it at least drivable and, you know, work on getting it inspected. But that's for the next video. So thank you guys for watching. And see you again in the next video.